just will take on a small example. 1 by 19, if you want to find, you can take any of the numbers. Don't think it is only valid for 19. That is beauty of the Vedic math. This is cyclicity of the numbers. You can take for any of the things, it will be valid. For current math, for everything different rule is there. If we are changing the power, then remainder theorem will change. If we are decreasing the power, then in place of, uh, in place of uh, you can say pattern method, we have to apply some other method. But here everything will be same. 1 by 19 we want to find by simple math, whatever we know, whatever we practiced from last many of the years during the school time and we know how to how to find, we have to keep on divide, we will get it. But through Vedic math, this sutra is Ekadikena Purvena, how we will able to able to write just from right to left based on the simple math, no need to put division, no need to put multiplication, only just two step, just to pick this is one you add next number it will become two just you will add one plus one it will become two these two will be factor multiplication these two will become factor multiplication this is nine then we have to just make the group of nine numbers from right hand side and we have to start with one just to put factor multiplication two it will be two factor multiplication two four factor multiplication two eight Factor multiplication 2, 16, 1 will be carry forward. Now you can 6 into 2 plus 1 carry forward 3. 6 into 2, 12 plus 1 carry forward 13, 3 will be here, 1 will be carry forward. Again 3 into 2 plus 1, it will be 7. Again, the same way we will go. 9, 4, 7, 3, 6, 8, 4, 2, 1. Just you keep on continue. We are not changing the principles. 9 into 2, 18, 1 will be carry forward. 8 into 2 plus 1, 8 into 2 plus 1. 17, 1 will be carry forward, 7 will be here. You keep on right. Finally, it will be like this. Once you are getting the 0, afterwards repetition will stop. And this you have to write 1 by 19, 0 point, 0 point. This is 9 digit, this is 9 digit. 18 digit we will able to write. Just you can say it is a just flow of the numbers. We are not doing anything. We are just <laughs> making the double. We are not doing anything. But just to find the simple math, how much difficult? How many division you have to do? And still finding 18 digit, it must be taken minimum 3 to 4 minutes. I am 100% sure. If you are very good in math also, if you are very good in math also, it will take 3 minutes to find the 18 digit after decimal. But here, it may take only 10 to 20 seconds. 20 seconds is more than enough. Just explanation, I, I have taken little bit, little bit more. Once you understood, it will take hardly 10 to 10, 20 seconds. Then you can understand how much it is going to be helpful. Value of pi up to 32 decimal, we will able to write just like a pattern. This is another pattern which we are using for uh, like uh, a spiritual purpose or uh, like Rangoli purpose. This is showing the repetition of time. Everything will repeat. Everything is going to repeat. This is your numerology. All are based on your number properties or number pattern. Everything. This numerology will be based on your number pattern. Astrology and like uh, this. Uh, like this how this 12 houses will be have for astrology that also we will it is a very interesting number pattern correct we will able to decide very easily how this will work out i'm not going to going to discuss today astrology or numerology just i'm giving you idea because this mathematics is so powerful it can calculate all odd type of things anything all we are dealing fraction Calculation of uh, calculation of a speed of life, time, whatever is there, we are dealing with the fraction. But calculation of fraction also, it is very easy. Even natural number or integral calculation, we are feeling feeling very difficult for with normal math. We are feeling very difficult because that method itself is premises itself is very limited. Premises is not allowing to think in different way. 